Okay, chat, up next is a new segment that we came up with just today. And uh, it's called Steam Spin. And the idea of this segment is there is a wheel, right? And I'll be doing like about 10 of these games. You can see the games. Now, now it's definitely not something like the wheel of the worst, but for Steam. But we're now using wheel technology, okay? This is not a particularly original bit, but I like it. And what we're going to do is um, go through some games that I don't even know why I have them. Because over the years, people have sent me games or I got like massive packs of games on Steam or maybe like games that were on sale. Here's like 40 games for 25 cents. Um, and, you know, I've never played them or I've played them for three minutes. So the vetting team and I went through my Steam library, mostly the vetting team, and they saw some of these games and they looked genuinely terrible. And we're going to check them out. So I had to install these games, and now my most recently played Steam games are all shit. And I want to be able to remove them entirely, but I don't know how to. So, uh, we're going to play them. And let's spin the wheel. You ready? There's a good game mixed in here, too. Hey, maybe some of these are kind of mediocre. Maybe some are terrible. Maybe some are good. I don't know. Well, we'll see what happens. Here we go. Spin! Floating point. Floating point. Floating point. Okay. Don't know what this game is. I recognize a couple names on this list, but I don't know all of them. So... Um... I feel like I might have played this. It's hard to remember, but I, I only had three minutes. This one's free. Oh. I might have played something like this. I don't know if I've played this exact one. But... Vinny, you got the good game on the first spin. <sighs> it's all downhill from here, chat. Gunpoint dev made this. I don't think I've played that game either, but yeah, I mean, I can see this being like um, just a game to like chill with if you're, you know, if you're in a state where there's legal le um, legal fun where you can like, be, you know, like chill with like um, not like plants or anything, but yeah, like like a plant from the earth. I don't know. is a bit loud that it is but yeah definitely be in a legal state or part of the world of course if you're going to play this game and like have like a super chill so my goal is to play these games at least, like, for a couple... Like, I don't want to say a specific amount of time, because what if I like the game a little bit, or what if it's funny? You know, generally, I want to put more than, like, two seconds worth of effort into the games. Maybe, like, five seconds, ten seconds? I don't really know if I like this game, though. I mean, I see what it's going for. And it is very familiar. I might have played it, but for only three minutes, it's possible. Regardless, uh, it's... If this is the best game of the day... Well, then th that kind of sucks. Oh. 
Okay. Let's see what the wheel brings us now. Bonus points because it was a free game. Day one, Gary's incident. Fuck, I was hoping this one wouldn't show up tonight. <sighs> this game, you, you can't even buy it anymore on Steam, and I don't know why I have it in my inventory chat. This game is relatively infamous. Okay, I'm loading the game. Don't get sued. Well, I didn't have it installed. You can still download the data from Steam. You just can't buy it. Um, that's the difference. Don't. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna throw V-Sync on just because this game is probably very poorly optimized. That's my guess. So apparently they tried to sue Total Biscuit, rest in peace, when uh, he said bad things about this game. That's what I'm learning now. So I'm not going to say anything bad about this game. I'm only going to say good things. Where the fuck is Gary? Dev even around anymore? That's what you do with the bottle. You pour it into your lap and then you take a swig of it. Gary, your package has arrived at the airplane hangar. Yeah, yeah, already. Roger. Apparently it was just DMCA for this game. The suing thing was another studio, so I'm not... I, I know it's loud. It's on 30% volume, and it's just really, really loud for some reason. Oh, game seems to be working perfectly. Right, QTEs right off the bat. Very nice. That's my favorite game mechanic. Only nice things will I say about this game. Did the body just explode? All that's left is hand. And leg. What the fuck? The lighting is very powerful in this game, too. Hmm. Do I save her life? <laughs> so that's what this game is. You have obtained a mango.
I wonder if the, the graphics will stop flickering at some point. Somehow V-Sync was causing the flicker? Sorry to keep going through the menus, but the, the audio is wildly inconsistent and fantastic, mind you, but very inconsistent volume-wise. That's better. Okay, um... You obtain- you have obtained a banana. The flickering is still with us. It will never be gone. So you can crap. What is this? What what is this game? It's a survival game. It's so it's not a story mode. want to see a little bit more of it. Like, I have to find out why this was in my inventory and why people know about this game. Crusty Rust? How did you get from Yellowstone to South America in a Cessna? Um, I don't know because the cutscene didn't work. I'm lost already. Maybe I have to light these candles? Survival sandbox game. Who's, who the fuck is Gary? Wow, I'm already fucking lost. Finding out where you are will be easier if you get out of the temple. So, the, the rules that I'm setting for this, I can't give up without at least experiencing what the game is, and I haven't done that. I haven't experienced a goddamn thing so far, chat. Hit the fire in the fire pits. Look at the pictures. Help. I've looked at the pictures, chat. I don't see anything. Nothing's happening. Blind? There, look up. Huh? Where, look up here? Huh? No. The picture says what you need to do. Well, there's web dings over here. 
Uh, so that's not helping me. Check one of the pillars. So I need to cut the rope. Rope will fall and then burn. Cut the rope. That looks like a, a reasonable thing to do. That, okay. All very reasonable, you see, chat. All very logical. I'll just avoid that fire. It's no problem, I can do that. Press control to walk silently and crouch. When you're behind the enemy, press E. Cyberpunk. Cyberpunk is a direct descendant of Day One, the Gary incident. Body disappeared. Well, how about I press these buttons? Uh, I guess that wasn't the right combination. Uh, I guess that wasn't the right combination. Combination. Good so far, chat. I need to bandage up. Oh, great, a QTE. Oh, I love QTEs, especially for when I'm bandaging. That's how you recover health. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. But what even is that? I should get out of here. Oh, there, there's some big screen shake. Oh, okay. I kind of deserve that. Well, how about I press these buttons? I'm sorry, I want to try one more time. I need to leave the temple and see what it looks like before I can say I've... I've seen enough of the game. I need to experience the game. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. Oh yeah, no, I've seen worse games on Sunday too.
None of this tutorial was in the original version of the game. This was the devs attempt at improving the experience as a chat member. In chat. If you can believe it. They were in chat when they said that. Running is actually headache inducing because of the screen shake. I will try one more time. Uh, how about I press these buttons? You know what? No, I won't. I'm going to go to Survivor Challenge. What was that? Did I fail the Survivor Challenge? Why... Why does it keep loading... My save file. Uh, how about I press these buttons? I'm doing it one more time. One more time. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. Oh yeah. How about I press these buttons? This is it, chat. If I die here, I'm good. I am putting this game to rest. I have to fight enemies while everything's shaking. Mission, get out of temple complete. Nathan Drakeson. <laughs> Ran out of memory exiting. Did it use all 64 of my rams? All of them? Oh, okay. Well, this works. Good. I just want to see a little bit of this so we get the full experience. Uh, this is not running so great. Making a shelter will help you face the dangers of the night. Why am I shocked that it's not running great? I don't know, because... I have 64 rams, and more. Monkeys? 
Oh, I don't want to hurt the monkeys, but I guess I need the meat. This dude just screaming at monkey. Get out! Oh! 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 All right, music, you can calm down. Kind of bad that I just killed that parrot. It's an ex parrot. It's, it's no more. You know, I just don't. I don't feel good about that. Oh, you can just borrow the feathers from the parrot without having to kill it. Game loves its dismemberment. Is that up there? Some kind of alien craft or futuristic spacecraft stuck in a tree. Dental floss? Dental floss! I guess the next move would be make shelter. Um, it's it's not really that clear. Uh, a lot of what you need to do probably isn't specified in game. Crafting a shelter. M maybe you just like guess. Um, okay, I'm gonna spend another just couple minutes on this because this is a fascinating. This is a fascinating video game. That was a rock. You threw a rock at me, monkey. If you shoot monkey, you automatically get meat. Well, I had to shoot the monkey. It was throwing rocks at me. Maybe I will get mauled to death by a Banjo-Kazooie in this cave. Alright, I think I'm about done. It's, yeah, I'm starting to see what it is. It, it reminds me a little bit of Crust. It has, um, survival elements, and it's just really... Like... It's, it's brilliant. Not janky at all. So it's not janky. It runs well on modern hardware, which is a miracle. It, um... Isn't glitchy. What else is it? Oh, it's, um... It's not obtuse. Like, it's, it's very clear what I'm... Like, what I can craft. It's all in-game. Good thing for that tutorial. And, uh, I just picked up panther guts. I was hoping maybe the panther could kill me. I have no honor. Say the truth, Vin. The devs aren't around anymore. If only there was an easier way to decipher what I was trying to say about this game. If only there was some way to know my true thoughts about this game. whole lot of nothing going on now. 60 more seconds. I just want to see a panther. I again, it would be great if a panther could just, like, maul me. That's all I want. It's 
It's also a very interesting way to hold a gun. I don't know, maybe it's for the best. I don't know what I'm talking about. Sorry, parrot. Your footsteps, at least. I need you to kill me. Please. Kill me. Not how I was expecting to go, but I'll take it. So this game does not handle alt-tabbing, uh, particularly well. You- you definitely don't want to tab out of this game. That's my advice to anyone who plays this, if anyone's seeking this game out. We're having a good time. Did that monkey go backwards? I'm safe here, chat. Alright, that was day one Gary's incident. I think the, the the game spoke for itself. Definitely does not suck big diseased Beetlejuice penis at all, in fact. So that's cool. Alright, well we got stuck on that one for a while. I knew we were gonna get stuck on that one for a while. But um Yeah. Let's see what remains on the wheel. On Steam Spin. We've got... No Time to Explain Remastered. That's a good game. Hammerhead's Deluxe. Uriel Ch Uriel's Chasm. I heard that game was pretty bad. Bunker Punks. Ace of Seafood. Cargo the Quest for Gravity. Brawl. Game Soup. And many more. YouTuber's Life. Another one I was hoping we wouldn't get. Again, I have no idea why this is in my inventory. Someone bought this for me, being cheeky, a couple years ago, and it just sat here. I have like 800 Steam games at this point. It's too many, chat. It's way too many. YouTuber's life, oh my god. I'll let you know how accurate it is. I made a YouTube video, like, like, once.
I think this is a good start, but I, I just want it to be a little bit more obnoxious. That's me, chat. Are you ready to be influenced? Here we go. Choose one personality type. Superstar. A master of viral videos. Your only ambition is to make more and more. Every viewer subscriber counts. Your obsession with money is nothing new. You're a business expert and you like to see every cent generated by your videos. Sociable. You love meeting new people and socializing. Meeting new friends is your favorite hobby and having an infinite contact list is your goal. Ugh. Genius. You don't care what everyone else thinks. Studying and learning new things is fun and easy. You apply yourself to your studies. Party animal. Is there anything more important than fame and popularity? You want to have fun without too many worries, so let's have a great time. Romantic. Your lifelong dream is to find a special person that makes your, you whole and won't stop until you find them. Your soulmate is waiting for you. Um... game is kind of loud. Yeah, all, all of these games have been loud. Um, I don't know, chat. What, what are we doing? Party animal? Gaming? Natural gamer. Joystick mastery. Music. Are you a rocker inside? Let's blast that guitar and reach for the stars. Cooking. Anyone can cook. Release your inner chef and fashion. Armani, never heard of him. Show your creations and set new trends. I'm gonna go gamer. That just seems to make the most sense. This, this is the only YouTuber types available, by the way. My name? My name? John Tuber. <laughs> name of channel. John Tube. John, John Tube. Reddit. One hundred. Gold. I started making my first video in this room. Oops. I had just moved in with my mom. I did not have a lot of friends around here. Let's take a look. First things I learned before becoming number one YouTuber. During those days, I had fun making videos of the games I had in my shelf. That's the shelf, right? Oh wait, no, that's not a shelf. What the fuck is this music? It's dangerous out there, get this. Wrong quote, but the same sprite from Zelda 1, chat. Choose game. We have one game. Empire Planet. It's a strategy game. Choose type. We'll, we'll do gameplay. We're, we can't collab yet because we don't have any, like, uh, subscribers. Choose a workstation. Station 1. Low resolution. No filter on the mic. And mono directional. Oh man, this is going to be great.
murderous look. Technical comment. What the fuck is this game? This is just exactly like real life, chat. Popularity, um... 78, console popularity, 64, interest, 70. Video editing skills are next level. Publish the video called Cock. I still get annoyed by the time it takes to upload a video on this channel, but let me tell you, watching your views, subscribers, and money, earn, grow is always exciting, but beyond... But, uh, sorry, besides, there's always a comment that helps me know whether I am doing it well with the video. I had a test every month, so I had to study. If I passed, I received a reward, but if I failed, my mother would certainly beat me to death. To go to school, I only had to go out the door of my room. That's- that's nice. It's convenient. I could always check if I was ready for my test by checking the calendar on my cell phone. Use your PC to shop. Amazing on. PC world and tech. Idea. I need to go. All consoles. Honey Play Studios. Honey Play Studios 2. Nikosoft Z-Box. This is absolutely insane. I'm gonna buy a pro HD camera. And if you, you do this, it'll show you, like, I have 103 views on the video that I just uploaded called Cock. Sorry for the curse words, chat. Webcam is here! Wow. I have zero subscribers. John Tube Reddit 100 Gold, zero subscribers, chat. Also, YouTube has not taken down the video for its disgusting name yet. Times you have to study. Times you have studied one. Um. Upgrade. I, I don't really think we need to spend too much more time on this, but I will make another gaming video. With our one video game. You gotta- you gotta know. You gotta know how to get those views. Funny critique. Every time I do a stream chat, this music is in the back of my mind. These videos are not compatible. You see? There's- there's video cut points. Render 8.5 hours.
Massive level up. Massive level up, chat. I'm really getting the hang of this. Keyboard, gamer keyboard has arrived. Buy another game. Congratulations, you are the 777th visitor to our online store. Keep reading to uh, reclaim your amazing prize. $20. I was just given $20. That is so unrealistic. Card collection. With more cards, chat, you become more better at, at streaming and making YouTube videos. Um, I should buy another video game. Let me let me buy another video game real quick. There's no video games here, but I could buy a fan or a lava lamp. Oh, oh, oh. Ha half lie two. Got it. Gorilla soccer two. What? Lort Battle for Upper Earth. <laughs> but you actually have to moderate your fake comments in this game too, I think. Yay! Yeah! I can unlock light bulbs now. But when do I eat food? Wait, I want to see how my, um... I want to see how my videos are doing. How do I check my videos again? Channel. Here we go. Uh, Click for Booba has 158 views, and that's it. Oh. All right, I'm gonna play Half Light 2, and then I'm gonna stop playing this game. I I'm, I'm good. man We're going to do gameplay but we're going to talk about the sea man who is the the mysterious character No one knows who he is We can't fit these things together again. I screwed up. I keep, like, attempting to do- I don't really know what I'm doing, but I keep attempting to make videos that don't fit. And now the render time is like 12 hours. This computer sucks. This is why you pay John Foles. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. We gotta crank and grind on that content right now, chat. Okay. Rank. Bank. Pranks gone wrong. Nut edition real girlfriend 
dumps. <laughs> It'll leave them wanting more. They don't know. They won't know. Dumps what? That's enough. Well, we got two of the longer games right off the bat. Yeah, I mean, listen, truth is this. I don't want to play that game again. However, if the wheel sees fit, it could be back on there and I'd have to play more of it. If we do this segment again in the future. Okay, here we go. Next, what will we get on Steam Spin? Minorino Director's Cut. I just, this one is the one that I actually bought today. I didn't have to buy any of this shit, but I had to buy this one, and I don't know why. I just, it was recommended. So, Minorino Director's Cut, it is. Here we go. Kind of hate the name of this thing. Oh no, it's this game. I thought it was like a joke on like, you know, mine, like, um, like a Minecraft thing, like minor, like minorino. I'm saying it wrong. It's actually Brazil. So this does not actually work particularly well. It has moved all of my desktop icons over. I feel like I've played a game with this dude. Cuando os comelios do espaco. Um, I'm, I don't want to say, I'm going to say all these words completely wrong. Pizza and cheeseburgers, though. Oh my god. Those are some fucking graphics. I've seen some graphics in my day, but these are some fucking graphics. Okay, okay. Now, I don't know if I've played this exact one, but I've played... I've used this character in a video game before. Yeah, this was like 50 cents. I think I played the Android version of this. Just gonna restart that music over and over again here. I can't believe Gilligan's Island music is playing. Well, it's probably better than the Android version, at least. Why is this on Steam? So many questions are raised. Some of the worst camera controls. As in, there are no camera controls. It's just, it's just camera chooses whatever angle it wants. Usually slightly to like, maybe like 35 degrees to the right. I like how picking up the pepper means I can no longer attack. It's a 
Good way to spend my Sunday night. I could be making a pizza right now, chat. Think about it. Making an actual pizza. Instead, I'm throwing them. And then you know what? I can make I can be a YouTuber. I can do pizza YouTube videos only. Make cool pizzas. I'll be honest, chat. This is a good game. <laughs> Um, the burp noise is really particularly disgusting, isn't it? I've heard this burp noise in so many other places, and I don't remember where, but it's- this is a common burp noise, chat. Sometimes you attack, sometimes you don't. Just wanna, like, get here. I just want to just explore a little bit more, and then I'm done with this. Oh god, that face! I'm not dead yet, but some very high-quality gameplay that we just witnessed. Sometimes you double jump, sometimes you don't. It's very dangerous, especially for big platforming things where you're about to get crushed with metal spikes. Which, again, like, where am I that there needs to be giant metal spikes? Oh, we, we've made some progress, chat. Is this when when people chat chat? This is Brazil. Everyone in chat is saying, "Vinny, this is Brazil. Come to Brazil." That's fair. That's that's fair. That's good. Fair and good. I'm very happy that that one's over. The camera in particular, of all things, was just... very bad. That is based on a Brazilian restaurant. Someone saying, check the credits. Okay, I will check the credits. get that refund it was 50 cents sponsorship dom zalutus zalitus All right. Good credits. Next. 
Why is Friday Night Funkin' Sunday stream material, says a chat member. We do good games on Sunday stream, too. It's not just weird or trash. We do good as well. But we're continuing the potential for trash right now. Let's spin the wheel. Mm. No time to explain remaster. Now, this is, I believe, a good game. Again, not really sure why I had this. Uh, I think I played the original a little bit, but... So, wasn't this, like, kind of a popular game, like, eight years ago, nine years ago, or more? Like, it was a Flash game at first? I am you from the future. There's no time to explain. Follow me to- OH CHRIST! Ah! This is the remaster. You remember this? Yeah, it's Raffle game. Peak 2010, you're not wrong. I can see my bones! Why? Oh boy. <laughs> The sense of humor. The sense of humor is is something. It's certainly something, all right. Why do I have this much blood? Ah! Maybe a little bit better than mine, even. Like slightly better than mine. Vinny, can't you walk? Oh yeah, you can walk, and you can jump, too. <laughs> I was like, don't you control this entirely with the gun? And the answer is no. I mean, sure, it's it's peak 2010, but it's all right. I mean, you just shoot and make your way through obstacles and stuff, and forget that you can walk and jump. There's a giant enemy crab. Mechanic with the gun, though, but you, know, you get used to it, I guess. Okay, I am you from the future. No time to ex. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay. New. Oh, it's just a bunch of new levels, I guess? This might be the remastered shit. Oh, the screaming, please. I can only scream so much. Oh, yeah. 
shark this time. Um, all right. Uh, I think we've we've gotten the idea of this game. Yeah, it's it's uh it's not bad. It's it is game. There is game here. It is the remastered version at the very least. This game came out in 2015. The remastered version did. So, yeah, it's fine. It definitely falls under the good game category of tonight for sure. No doubt about that. It's not day one. I, I mean, it's not uh, day one Gary levels of good, but it's pretty good. We make fun of this game's humor, but imagine in 10 years where we'll cringe at what's funny today. Honestly, yes. You're not wrong. Though, I would still say some some humor, some comedy that I grew up with has lasted forever. Monty Python is still my favorite. That's just me, though. What? Kapusi is forever. Joker stares is cringe. Yeah, I'm the only one that still likes Monty Python. They're still one of the most popular comedy groups of all time, but I'm I'm the only one. All right, listen. Here we go. Let's roll this stupid thing and see what we get next. Aside from regret at creating this segment. Ace of Seafood. Okay. Ace of Seafood. Again, don't know when I got this. It was just there. Okay. Tell us your background. Mackerel, sardine, shrimp, spiny lobster, salmon. Wow, we have memes with two of these creatures, chat. Salmon and the shrimp fresh. Try the shrimp. Um, I don't know the best way to handle this game. Maybe controller? shooter game? I was not expecting Ace Combat. This is another good one. It's really weird, but I, I think so far it's, it's kind of great. And you can dig through the ground too? What the fuck? This is good! How have I never played this? Got it, not sure. Each species has multiple different abilities. Change the formation of your allies. You can have them attack with you or act as bait. Direct blows are more destructive than ranged attacks. What the fuck? This is like an early form of Crab Champions, which sadly hasn't come out yet, but... That game is gonna be very good when it does come out. 
Crab Champions is maybe one of my most anticipated games for 2021. Uh, Same dev? No shit. Save your progress and recover units by entering a reef. The more reef you obtain, the more schools of creatures you can maintain. I'm ready. Organized squadrons. Oh my god. I, this might be a little bit too much for me to learn right now, but holy fuck. Fight crab devs, not crab champions. Oh. Controlling two shrimps. I think I accidentally set it into two player mode. Um. Yeah, then there's the, the, the stuff here. Block and attack. Ally circle around you. Fire at will. Auto return. I don't think I'm going to play too much more of this. I feel like it's all very in-depth to get the good stuff out of it. But um, let me just go to title screen real quick. Let's see if there's anything else. Prawn number one. Let me just maybe get out of... Formation. Two player. Remove. I don't want to do two-player, though. I think it's trying to make the keyboard two-player. Oh, wait, well, it detects a controller twice, perhaps. I have multiple inputs. You're right, I do. And I don't know how to change that. There's two lights on the controller, so that might have something to do with it. All right. Cool game. That game was, like, maybe the best game I've played tonight, actually. Let's spin the wheel. A couple more times. Brief Karate Foolish. What is the name of this game? Brief Karate Foolish. That is a... Oh no, what is this picture? Oh no, what is this game? I am on 7% volume as a result of this game. It's not really working. Let me try again. I might have to try to window this because it's not working in full screen mode. Brief Karate Foolish. Uh, I know you want to see the game, but I can't, I can't, I can't let you do that, Star Fox. Not right now, at least. It keeps fucking with my icons and, and desktop. People are saying it's not possible to capture. It really doesn't seem possible to capture this game.
desktop capture instead of window, um, what, nothing's really showing up. Win 7 compatibility mode. I don't know how to do that. From Steam. The other thing is the controls aren't working. Like, it, there was an option menu, but it didn't do anything. Yeah, and every time I move a thing, it fucks with my icons. This is not a good game. Not from a, a fucking stability standpoint. Um, I, I might chat, I might have to just show you a video of this. Choose your fighter. It's just a bunch of Japanese men in underwear, chat. If I go now to use um, XSplit, the game will not work. Well, I don't know how to capture this. This this is a conundrum. Uh, this is definitely a conundrum for another time, but I can show you a video of it because it might be worth seeing a video, but it's it's not worth me trying to figure this out right now when pressing buttons literally opens things on my desktop chat. I found a video from 2017 displaying special moves. So... Enjoy. Sorry, I can't play this. But this is the game. I don't know who bought this for me, but I really... I really hate them. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. Yeah. Is that who wants to be a millionaire? <laughs> okay. You chose the wrong answer, now you must die. Well, there you go. Now you got two minutes of brief karate foolish. Just pretend I played it. If it was possible to capture this, I would have, but holy fuck. Um, the game just fucked my desktop and was not participating at all. So that's, I guess, part of the, the wheel. You know, that's one of the wheel problems we have on the stream. Sorry, let's check the next set of gamer. Are you ready? Speed! Hammerheads Deluxe. Hammerheads Deluxe.
Most of these games are um, not kind to my um, desktop. Like, they put all my icons on the right monitor, and they do bad things to my computer. Yeah, it changes resolutions. It's just not particularly streamlined. Um, this is a problem I haven't had to deal with in a very long time. Just a second here, chat. I don't even know if I can capture this. Let me see if there's options or alt-tab. Or alt-enter, rather. Okay, alt-enter worked. Alright, we're gonna try this one more time. Hammerheads Deluxe, here we go. This looks like a Flash game. Also, whoo! Hit the gnomes until they break. Try not to miss. Do not let gnomes escape. They really just be packaging whack-a-mole again. I, I, <laughs> I heard the Curlin Nescar. Which is, in fact, not how you say that at all. That was just a purely a Plinket invention, the, the word Nescar. It's like Curlin Nyskios or something? I don't know. But anyway, yeah, it's it's uh it's it's a game that would have been fine in 2002. Yeah, you click the gnomes. This would have been cool, like when I first got my computer and used the mouse for the first time. I would have been like, yo, the mouse is so fun. Or a twenty-dollar Wii game. But you see what they're doing right now? They're throwing, like, different gnome types. So the variety is definitely there. Soon they may even have enemy types that you don't want to hit. Or they may have enemy types that, like, take three hits. I don't know, chat, anything's possible. I'm just gonna try to upgrade my, uh, I have money. But it doesn't seem like there's an upgrade feature. Marathon Bash. It just opened another link. It, it opened a link in Steam by pressing that button. Yeah, uh, what can you say? It's it's whack a gnome. Then you have to click on the money. Too late. All right. All right. Now listen, chat. We're getting to the end of this segment, but we've got a little bit more. Not every game will be played tonight, and that's the thing that makes the wheel interesting. We can't play every game on the wheel. But, what we could do is add them to the part two segment, where we go through, see what's available, see what's left, and then maybe we see them again one day. But, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine games left on the wheel, chat. That means I'll be doing two or three more games, and then the rest go unplayed. Oh, Jesus. 
Minorino Shooter DC, and I know I'm saying that wrong. God damn it. Yes, there was another Minorino game. and I... Locale, data path, not found. Okay. Minorino Shooter DC. Oh, there, there's dragons and stuff. Ain't it? Ain't it? Oh my god. Wait, uh, controls are very interesting. You hold up to go forward. Right? You hold up to go forward. And then right and left, you know, go up and down. All they had to do was make it so that the directions were correct. But okay, here we go, here we go. Uh, uh, uh. Did a little damage there, or that was bullet time, I'm not really sure. The bullets all have physics. Interesting. I like the JPEG background, though. Like, you can really see the artifacting. Why, yeah, why is the bar on the top left going mental? Okay. Vinny, look at the pipe when you die. Oh god, the pipe is long. Andy's room wallpaper? I'm trying, chat. I'm really trying. <sighs> also, that reminds me. I don't know why. I think maybe because I, I said something from the Star Trek Picard. I'm really trying. But I had a dream last night that Smooth Captain Picard was at an award ceremony, and I was there for some reason. But he was... It was Patrick Stewart, but he was smooth, and it was in a subway terminal. And, like, if you went through enough corridors, it would be, um, smooth. And then you get there. And I remember there being a protest against trains because trains bad and I had to like go through there and they're like, what are you going to ride a fucking train? I'm like, well, yeah, I need to get to the award ceremony. Patrick Stewart's there. And then, uh, then he won an award. So anyway. I also remember there being confetti in the air at one point. I don't remember the rest. Mi ne ri ni mi ne ri Mi ne ri is how you say this apparently. Okay, everybody. Uh we've got one or two more games to check out, depending on what the next game is. Let's go for a spin. Game soup. Okay. Oh, 
awful way to start a game with that cool noise, but I'm not complaining about that too much more after this. Just that one time. Okay, Game Soup. Vinny, you played this? I certainly don't remember it. If I did, you sure it was me? Is this WarioWare? All right, Chad, I finally played Undertale. You happy? Riveting. I did it. All right. Increase zeal. Okay. It's just like WarioWare. I'm not complaining, I kind of like it so far, but... And I can play with a controller. <laughs> it's fine, so far. But it's not just Nintendo franchises, clearly. It's, it's you know... Uh, it's doing a bunch of stuff. Oh. Was that an Argonian? I think that was an Argonian chat. Sequence one, two, three, four complete. Brain tire pumpkin. An apple. Uh, one. So where should we go on our date? Uh, the mall. Not not hell or a graveyard, clearly. That wasn't Bunny Yusando, though. So, not accurate. Ah, uh, no, the part fish. See now what I had to do. Haunt. Haunt. <laughs> so it, was, it was a Steven parody. Kung Fu. I could do one more. Yeah, it's a decent little game. I'll, I'll try it again because there's so much variety. Oh, the goal here is to... Oh, okay. to press the button.
classic. Two items, top shelf, one counter, one middle shelf. Lizard man is wanted. Uh, museum. <laughs> Eat brain and not poop. I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I went into the poop. Who is this brother? <laughs> Who is this guy? What? New brother confirmed. I was just watching a video on Mario bootlegs today, too. Oh. Probably not going to get to the boss. You got it! It's Spinx. What's his name? Spanx. S-P-A-N-X. Snake. Oh, that was, yeah, that was, that was Snake, alright. I love these, like, bootleg versions of characters we all know. This is just press the button fast a lot. Like, a lot fast. Many times a lot. Oh, it wasn't about you. Okay. I was like, oh, I'll just pop the bubble. That's how you do this. No, 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 no. That was a good one. Ah! <gasps> uh... Yeah, this is good. If you're, like, a WarioWare fan and you're upset we haven't gotten, like, too much new Wario, apparently the game's a buck. Not too bad. Chat, do you want me to spin the wheel one more time? Do we do the spin? All right, one more time. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven games left, which means after this, six will be going into the grinder. Brawl. B R. You can't see it because this thing. It says Brawl. B R O L L. All right. I know you wanted Amazing Frog, but maybe next time. Maybe Amazing Frog will never come up on this segment. Maybe. Maybe no. I. You know what? I've played Amazing Frog on the Ouya years ago, but I haven't played Amazing Frog in its current incarnation. So just saying, there's a lot of Amazing Frog's content I haven't seen. But there will be more of this uh, Steam Spin. Just not tonight, clearly. We gotta save some. Okay, so this is Brawl. 
Uh, I, I couldn't venture a guess as to what kind of game this was. Customize your character. Alright, so far. Good customization. figure out how to run. Okay. Wow. Love, love that movement options. I'm using a controller and yet like, I can't use the options. Turn motion blur off. That doesn't matter. Um, just... Maybe we can... Decrease the fucking speed of the, the right stick when I use the camera. Nope. No, it has to be crazy fast. It has to be. Oh, God. The slightest motion on the right stick, chat. Alright, I'm not using a controller for this, because controller is ass. Hang on a minute. Remember that little gnat I told you about? There's like a little fly. He's on the monitor right now. I found him. And now, he has given his life to the cause. I'm sorry, Nat. But why, why, why does the ragdoll turn in me into fast? This game certainly be weird. Certainly be pretty bad. The pink bit is a booster. Um, yeah. physics chat. It's just pure, simple, plain physics. Walk on cosmetics to unlock them. Oh, I did it. Confirm. We can customize the character now, chat. So this is the whole game, then.
Someone just said, I saw these assets on the Unreal Marketplace like 30 minutes ago. I mean, really the question is, what assets? Funny. <laughs> What a concept. Uh, maybe they were hoping for YouTuber bait. I mean, it worked. Here I am. Then again, I've had this for a while. I, I just don't know... ...who or why. Who or why is the best question. I don't know. Oh, look, it's Fall Guys. See, this was a concept that was further improved in Fall Guys. Like, the, um, customization options are just floating around. <laughs> what the fuck? No! No, I was- I was win! Okay, I'm, I'm about to... I'm about to be done playing this. <laughs> Fuck is this gameplay? Is this Jape Frog? No, Amazing Frog actually has a lot more content than this. And also, too, like, you kind of have to just get lucky. Some of these don't really have any, um, like, sure ways. Wow. Get lucky. Sound of the summer. I wonder if you can unlock further ass customization. Since that seems to be a big focus of the game. I mean, it's not the worst thing I've played tonight, and I can actually play it, and it, you know, works. That's important. Yeah, crotch bang! Yeah! Yeah, crotch bang! Let this be the image that defines this particular game. R remember this, if you remember nothing else. Anyway, thank you for watching Steam Spin, the new segment where I get rid of my backlog of Steam games. Um... Wow. That was certainly a thing. Some good ones, some bad ones, some really bad ones, but, I'm sure this will happen again. Wheel technology is good technology and can be used for video gaming. It's very powerful. Everybody, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to take a quick break. I'll be back with a game called Friday Night Funkin'. But first, how about more of this? Friday night, Friday night, Friday night, Friday night, Friday night.
Please, 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 please